Good day everybody, welcome to today's video. Today's video, we're actually looking at something that's gonna be useful instead of a boring OBD2 scanner that can only do basic code readings. Today we're taking a step away from that nonsense. We're gonna look at a battery tester. Focus. We're gonna have a look at this Topton Arty Battery 101 battery test, cranking test, charging test. Pretty interesting. So what's nice about this one to help you troubleshoot is that the battery charge state selection so we're gonna hook it up to my Jeep we're gonna put it on before charging because my Jeep's been sitting in here for quite a long time check our battery type and we'll see what happens there's a few features on this one we're gonna have to use the Ford on boots up blue screen maybe not a blue screen maybe she's bleeding through let's just peel that off so 12.22 volts English in vehicle before charge I believe this is a AGM or gel cold cranking apps well it gives you two it's not zero degrees so we're gonna go 890. Does it have to fast forward? Yes, it does. Come on, 890. Doing the old test right there. State of health 95%. State of charge 38%. I believe that's what that means. Good recharge. Apparently there is a cranking test and a charging test. We'll have to go to the Ford for that. The truck's been sitting for a while. The voltage is a little lower. Display set. Uh, I don't want to do that. Let's go English. I don't want to do it. How do you get to the other ones? What is this one? 925 cold cranking amp 750. Uh, we punch in 750. Well, it's zero degrees, so let's go 925. This one's good. Oh, there you go. Cranking test. Start engine. It's been sitting for like a week. Charging test. Couple little things here, the cranking test, which is pretty interesting to know. Um, it says right there, this is for the convenience of the mechanics to quickly know the whole state of the charging system according to the data. After testing finished, do not shut down the engine, press OK to enter charging test. We went through the charging test, I did not increase um, the RPM, so it came back charging volt low. My alternator doesn't seem to be having any issues, so I'm not worried about it. Reading 14-ish volts. That's, you know, I'm pretty happy with that. 
This is actually pretty impressive. I'm telling you right now, the last battery tester I did a review on, which is a good one too, but it only can test the state of the battery. This one tests your charging system, tests your starter, for cranking time and everything else. This will definitely come in handy. I'm gonna end the video here. If you guys have any questions or comments, post them below. And I wanna thank you guys for watching this video. And if you're a Jeep fan, we got a lot of Jeep videos coming up in the future. So I'll talk to you guys later.